Hi, it's Tim at Vlogistics, and I wanted to take a few minutes to show off some of the features from our latest release. Now, like always, new updates are released for all customers all at once, so you will see these features the very next time you log into Vlogistics. Now, first, we've completely replaced the email editor. Uh, it includes the same basic formatting options we had in the old editor with a few changes. In addition to looking sleeker and more modern, the new editor comes with some new features as well. The biggest improvement is how you can put images in your email messages. Now, with the old editor, you needed to upload your image to a third-party hosting site like Imager, find the direct URL, and then paste it into your message. It was terrible. Now you can add your image right in Volgistics. Click the button here to upload it, or just drag and drop it right here, and Volgistics handles the rest. Next, placeholders. We've always had a few placeholders or email codes for things like volunteer names and PIN numbers. And these allowed you to personalize the messages that you send out, but you had to know the code and manually type it in each time you wanted to use it. The new editor has a placeholder button right on the toolbar, so you can select the placeholder you want to use and insert it automatically. No more memorizing codes or looking them up every time. In addition, we've added a larger variety of placeholders here so your messages can really shine. Have you ever typed out a long email just to have it get cut off halfway through when your volunteers receive it? It was embarrassing for you, and it was embarrassing for us. So we've greatly expanded the maximum size for your email messages. Uh, in addition to that, we're considering the total size of the message now instead of having the content and the attachments count separately. Plus, you'll see this indicator here in the corner, so you'll know long before you get to any maximums. Speaking of losing long emails, if you've ever walked away in the middle of composing one, you may have come back to an expired session and all your work being lost. This is why we implemented a new autosave feature that will look for changes every few minutes and save your work for you, so you don't lose precious time redoing the same work. But wait, there's more. We didn't just add this editor to emails, we added it basically everywhere we could think of. This includes things like volunteer notes, assignment descriptions, instruction fields in setup, and even application forms. So now you can give new applicants clickable links to things like agreements, disclosures, waivers, or even to pay for registration fees. And all of this comes for the low, low price of zero dollars because support and upgrades are included as part of your Vlogistics service fees. Now, I sincerely hope that these new features will help you communicate more clearly with your volunteers and just improve the overall look and feel of Vlogistics in general. If you have any questions about these new updates or anything else in Vlogistics, I really encourage you to reach out to the support team uh, and use some of the new formatting there too, and we'll get back to you quickly. Thanks for watching and keep an eye out for some more exciting updates coming down the line soon.